So as everyone can see on the screen right now, we are fighting pirates. What's the pirates you might ask? Technically, later in this video, you'll see a flying Dutchman, which will be the pirate ship. If you have 1.4, there's a chance it could drop the flying pirate ship mount. But there's a chance it could drop a wand that will summon a tiny pirate to fight for you. But yeah, he looks like he's the size of a baby, but he also does have a beard. So, uh, how do you like my, uh, baby shark? If you can see on the, uh, uh the right screen, which is me, the left screen is Gabriel. So, we got some really cool loot from hell. I drained out the whole entire Atlantic Ocean so that it would be more easier to fight the pirates at the east side of the beach. This mostly works in journey mode. If you get uh, like a lot of plantinium coins, you might have to duplicate it and get rich. Which gables full of plantinium coins, so I hope you all know that. I just want to know, is my mic working? Because I've uh, attempted to make this video two times. But my mic was not working two times. Or this headset just might be broken. Okay, as you can see, a flying Dutchman has spawned. In the 1.4, you don't have to kill the pirates. Technically, if you do, it'll take longer for a flying Dutchman to spawn. But in... 1.23, it'll technically you have to kill the pirates in order to summon the flying Dutchman. <coughs> okay. As you can see, the flame lash is the most useful item against the flying Dutchman. It's so against the pirates and the parrots. I don't get how you can die to a parrot. I love parrots. Because Parrots uh, are really adorable. If fun fact, I hate birds, not for, p but not parrots though. What are you doing? Oh, hey there, little parrot. What are you doing? Oh, I'm just recording a video. Mommy. What? Mommy. Oh yeah, this is Perry the parrot. So uh, talk to him. Such big cow and. Never miss a video. Pick bye. Bye bye.